This is Into the Multiverse with Josh Peck. Hello and welcome to Into the Multiverse. I am your host, Josh Peck. Now, if you haven't had a chance to do so, make sure you subscribe and click the bell for notifications. So we have a very interesting story today. Scientists may have just taken a step forward in proving the existence of Hawking radiation. Until now, this has been a theory, uh, but there might be proof now. So using what's called an optical fiber analog of an event horizon, uh, which is a lab-created model of black hole physics, research Researchers from Welsman Institute of Science in Rehovot, Israel, uh, they report that they've created stimulated Hawking radiation. Now, under general relativity, a black hole is inescapable. Once something travels beyond its event horizon into the heart of the black hole, there is no return. In fact, the gravitational force of a black hole is so intense that not even light which is the fastest thing in the universe, as far as we know, can achieve uh, velocity. Black holes even greatly alter time itself around the event horizons. So due to this, general relativity says that a black hole emits no electromagnetic radiation. However, Stephen Hawking, uh, back in 1974, theorized that black holes actually do emit something when you add in uh, modern understanding of quantum mechanics. This theoretical electromagnetic radiation is what is called Hawking radiation. It resembles what's called black body radiation produced by the temperature of the black hole, which is inversely proportional to its mass. So this radiation would mean that black holes are extremely slowly and steadily evaporating, but according to the math, this radiation is too faint to be detected by our current level of technology. This is why today scientists are trying to recreate it in a lab using black hole analogs. These can be th these can be built from things that produce waves such as fluid and sound waves in a special tank from Bose-Einstein condensates or from light carried in optical fiber. Physicist Ulf Leonhardt recently told Physics World, quote, Hawking radiation is a much more general phenomenon than originally thought. It can happen whenever event horizons are made, be it in astrophysics or for light in optical materials, water waves, or ultra-cold atoms, end quote. We are told that these experiments will not reproduce the gravitational effects of a black hole, which is obviously a good thing because if they did, the planet and probably most of the solar system would be destroyed. But the math involved is analogous to the math that describes black holes under general relativity. So this time, the team's method of choice was an optical fiber system developed by Leonhardt some years ago. The optical fiber has micro patterns on the inside and acts as a conduit. So when entering the fiber, light slows down to just a tiny bit to create an event horizon uh, analog to differently colored and uh, incredibly fast pulses of laser light are sent down the fiber. The first interferes with the second, resulting in an event horizon effect, which is then uh, observable as changes in the refraction index of the fiber. Now, the team then used an additional light on this system, which resulted in an increase in radiation with a negative frequency. So, in other words, negative light was drawing energy from the event horizon, which is an indication of stimulated Hawking radiation. Now, while the findings were certainly interesting, the end goal is for this kind of research to observe uh, spontaneous Hawking radiation. Stimulated emission is exactly what it sounds like. It's an emission that requires an external electromagnetic stimulus. Now, of course, in nature, the Hawking radiation emanating from a black hole would be spontaneous rather than stimulated. There, there's other problems with stimulated Hawking radiation experiments. For example, it is impossible to precisely recreate the conditions around an event horizon uh, within a lab. With this experiment, it's difficult to be 100% certain that the emission wasn't created by an amplification of normal radiation, although Leonhardt and his team are confident that their experiment did actually produce Hawking radiation. Either 
either way, it's a fascinating story, uh, and it's, it's really interesting to look at this, and uh, th- this type of experiments, this type of information has provided another mystery for this team. They found the result was not quite as they expected. Leonhardt told Physics World also, quote, Our numerical calculations predict a much stronger uh, hawking light than we have seen. We plan to investigate this next, but we are open to surprises and will remain our own worst critics, end quote. Now, for more information on this, the research has been published in the journal Physical Review Letters. Now, as usual, I want to know what you think about all of this. Please leave me a comment in the comment section below uh, if you're viewing this on YouTube. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for notifications. All right, everybody, have a great week, and until next time, take care and God bless. As many as 80% of Americans are carrying a time bomb. A medical crisis in their bodies right now, unaware that they will soon develop prolonged chronic illness, autoimmune disease, or even cancer. Today's frightening truth is citizens are being poisoned every single day without their knowledge. A health epidemic largely brought on by industrialized food is destroying our genetics and immune systems through deadly modified organisms, carcinogenic materials, and life-threatening chemicals commonly found in most of today's processed groceries. Coming this April in the groundbreaking new book, Time Bomb, by Joe Artis Horn and Ali Anderson. You'll be put in charge of your health once again as commercial marketing games are exposed and the expose of the year unveils how easy it is to avoid toxic ingredients, identify organic and safe foods, and make healthy eating affordable. You will learn how neuroscience is confirming an amazing gut-brain connection that holds the key to maintaining physical, hormonal, emotional, and mental wellness. With powerful insights from health professionals for maintaining superior physiology and reversing chronic illness without a weight loss diet, Time Bomb is set to become your most important field guide for avoiding a national health epidemic more pervasive than anyone could have ever imagined. Time Bomb. There is a genocide of deadly processed foods happening right now in the United States, creating a health epidemic more pervasive than anyone ever imagined. But now you can arm yourself with the knowledge to keep you and your family from becoming its next victim. Skywatch TV is proud to announce the Time Bomb special offer. When you order Time Bomb from the Skywatch TV store, you'll also receive the Time Bomb Companion DVD. This incredible DVD includes special, never-before-released, off-the-record interviews with healthcare professionals like Dr. Ralph Umbriaco, Dr. Joshua Vance, and Dr. Matthew Sams on the current food crisis in the U.S., and tips on how to achieve your optimal physiological health. This DVD is nearly five hours in length and also includes the entire Skywatch TV Time Bomb television series with Joe Horn, Ali Anderson, and Derek Gilbert. But that's not all. You'll also receive Eat This and Live for Kids. This colorful, fully illustrated book by Dr. Don Colbert walks you step by step through how to begin teaching your kids to love the foods that will love them back. While out shopping, how to avoid deadly toxins in many common kids' foods and household products, what to feed your kids from preschool to preteen, healthy snacks they will love, and what supplements they'll desperately need, and so much more. But the health epidemic isn't just limited to humankind. Also included in this unbelievable special offer, Joe Artis Horn's best-selling book, The Dead Pets Don't Lie Expose, and Companion DVD. This shocking book and DVD collection sounds the alarm on the scandalous practices of the commercial pet food industry. Learn how the FDA is allowing big scams where detestable, poisonous pet foods are being passed off as healthy and causing pets to die prematurely. You'll learn everything you need to know in order to quickly read pet food labels and allow your pet to avoid these toxic ingredients. Sold separately, these items hold a retail value of over $100. Yours now for a donation of only $30 plus shipping and handling. 
Take control today. The Time Bomb special offer is your field guide to avoiding the deadly processed foods and ingredients that are creating a massive wave of health crisis in America. This information covers every member of the family, the adults, children, and even our pets. Begin transforming how you and your family eat and live now. The Time Bomb special offer. Order now at the Skywatch TV store online or call 844-750-4985.